in its effort to recover goods, equipment, and other commodities that were taken from their rightful places during the recent unrest in Monrovia, the Ministry of Commerce, Industry, and Transportation is requesting all churches and mosques to serve as centers where found goods and commodities that are proceeds of the recent disturbances could be stored until collected by government. The Ministry will therefore be pleased where the churches and mosques to appoint responsible members of the congregation to be present at the church and mosque to receive and store said commodities and goods. It is expected that the churches and mosques shall immediately inform the ministry about said goods and commodities being in the possession in order that arrangement for the obtention and transfer to government central storage facilities may be made. This announcement is signed by John F. Sherman, Minister of Commerce, Transportation and Industry. Another announcement here, the public in general is warned not to buy goods. Again, the public in general is warned not to buy goods, equipment or commodities from anyone in the streets or by way. You could be held for receiving stolen property. Make sure you buy from authorized dealers only and keep your payment receipt just in case. Save yourself embarrassment. Don't buy just from, en from just anyone. Go to the authorized dealer. And this announcement is also signed by John F. Sherman, Minister of Commerce, Transportation and Industry. The Minister of Commerce, Industry and Transportation wishes to advise the business community and the recent demonstration that the recent demonstration which affected the commercial atmosphere in Monrovia has been brought under complete control. The Ministry is therefore advising that all business firms which have not yet commenced operation and were not affected by the recent disturbances should commence operation as usual at 8 a.m. tomorrow morning, April 20, as they can be assured that the commercial atmosphere has returned to normal and all is safe for the smooth operation. This announcement is also signed by John F. Sherman, Minister of Commerce, Industry and Transportation. Industry and Transportation, in conjunction with the Liberian Chamber of Commites, invites representatives of the following groups to a meeting on Tuesday, April the 24th at 9.30 a.m. in the conference room of the Liberia Chamber of Commerce on Capitol Hill. And they are the Council of the Chamber of Commerce, insurance companies, banks, the Indian Business Association, the Lebanese Business Association, representatives of all business houses affected by the re recent looting, automobile dealers association, the pharmaceutical association and travel and airline agencies and shipping companies. Please be present and on time as matters of vital importance will be discussed. And this announcement... Marlboro. 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 As a result of the demonstration on Saturday, pardon me, the National Bank of Liberia wishes to inform the public that due to the curfew imposed in Monrovia and its environment, all commercial banks and other financial institutions will be closed to the public at 12 noon instead of 2 p.m. on April the 20th. Relatives who wish to clean borders as a result of the demonstration on Saturday, April the 14th, should immediately contact the Ministry of Health and Social Welfare Sinko Office for burial arrangements to be made. The office will be opened from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Monday through Friday. And this announcement is signed by Kate C. Bryant and the Minister 